All right. Hello, everybody. Today, I am going to just take a minute and talk to you about how I did this and what to expect if you do it. So what is this? It is a complete distal, meaning near the elbow, rupture of my inner bicep head. This one. Okay. How did I do that? Honestly, I have no idea exactly why it happened, but it was just during normal chin-ups. Um, I do hundreds of chin-ups in an exercise. No idea why this one gave. Uh, the doctor said it might have been the angle, but she also expressed that as compared to when you're doing pull-ups, when you do chin-ups, because you turn this way, it puts tension on that inner head. And then whenever you hang, you're putting tension with the twist and with the hang, and you're putting it all on the elbow. And so I uh, went down to a dead hang. I burst up to the top. As soon as I hit the top, I heard it pop. Uh, I lowered myself down and looked, and sure enough, my bicep was all balled up up here, uh, like a Popeye muscle. Uh, I went to the emergency room. Uh, at the emergency room, they did an x-ray to confirm that there was no damage to the bone, and they put me in a sling, and they referred me for ortho uh, the very next day, or in this case, Monday. I went to Elite Orthopedics. Uh, they looked at it immediately knew that it was a complete tear because of the physical deformity, sent me for an MRI. MRI confirmed what they already knew. They saw me the next day and scheduled me for surgery. Um, as soon as surgery was scheduled, they had me get uh, an EKG and two separate blood panels to make sure that I was good for surgery and anesthetics. Uh, those all came back and two weeks to the day of my injury, I went in for same day surgery. Uh, I went in at 6 a.m. I was in surgery by 7.30, uh, and I was home by 11.30. Uh, still groggy from the anesthesia, slept most of the day. Uh, they gave me some mild painkillers and told me to use ibuprofen and ice for the swelling. Uh, initially, I did not take that advice seriously. I just took the painkillers and I was experiencing a lot of pain in the radius bone uh, and my thumb in particular. I later discovered that was due to the swelling, um, squishing against my partially casted arm. So I started taking the ibuprofen and as long as I keep up with that, the pain is pretty tolerable. Um, the procedure itself, the way it was explained to me, uh, they put about a four centimeter cut in my forearm. They use an x-ray to make sure they're right over the radius bone. They drill a hole in the radius bone and they put a button on said bone. And once they put the button on that bone, uh, they then pull the tendon through and tie it off to that bone so that it'll heal back on. I've got about two weeks where it's a partial cast uh, and it's wrapped in just standard wrapping and I have to keep it immobilized with this. Um, the pain yesterday was pretty bad. Uh, once I got the swelling down and understood that the way the swelling affected the pain, um, the pain has been pretty tolerable. That said, I went to sleep, I slept a full eight hours, so in eight hours, all the medications were out of my system, and I woke up in a crazy amount of pain. Um, I would not recommend that. I, I would say tonight I'll set an alarm for midway through the night. I would rather wake up and take my meds on time and then try to go back to sleep, because once I was woken by the pain, you know, I was chasing that pain most of the morning uh, and I haven't been able to go back to sleep since. Uh, what comes next for me is really unclear exactly how it'll go. I know that in like 14 days I'll go see her, she'll take this off. I know I'll remain in the sling for I think four weeks and then after the four weeks we start rehabbing the bicep. My doctor said that I don't necessarily need to do physical therapy, that I have a pretty firm understanding of how to grow the muscle um, and how to recover. So she's just gonna monitor me and allow me to attempt to do it myself initially. That's her recommendation. Um, I have a friend who's a physical therapist, so uh, I have nothing against physical therapy. I think that you, unless you're experienced, should definitely do it. There is a risk that you won't get full range of motion. That's all I have today. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments. Uh, if you wanna ask me privately, you can send me a message and I'll answer them. 
Uh, assuming that there's anything noteworthy happens moving forward, I will post more videos in the future about my recovery and uh, how things go. Uh, in the meantime, stay safe and uh, be careful with those chin-ups. They can be tricky.